With you saying that and praising him, you beating him like you did, what does that say about you now, being 28-0, 12-0 in UFC? I don't know. I hope, you know, it's like, you know what's interesting in this sport? Even if you're 28-0, 12-0 in UFC, you're one of the biggest stars. You smash everybody. People are going to talk about, you have to fight with him, you have to fight with him, you have to fight with him. Give me just respect. Put me on number one pound for pound fight next week. And uh, because I think I deserve this, because I dominate, you know, with all my opponents. I am undefeated, you know. And uh, I think I deserve some respect. And you talk, you obviously care about your legacy and stuff a lot. Um, everyone wants to, this Tony Ferguson fight to happen. It's fell apart four times before. Dana said that's the next fight as long as he accepts it. How important is it for this fight to happen finally? My next opponent is very good steak with burger double cheese. I won this one, you know, and with some juice with ice. I want to enjoy a little bit. Give me a couple of days, guys, please. Dana has said that Tony Ferguson is next. When do you want to do it? Next burger. I want to eat some burger and steak. <laughs> please give me a couple of days rest. You guys want to put me tomorrow on cage, you know. Please give me a little bit rest, you know. Last two years, it was very busy for me, you know. So like 18, 19, you know, 2018, 2019. Please give me a little bit rest, you know. It's like maybe a couple of days. Brother, for me, burger with double cheese. Okay. Okay, okay. No more cutting weight. No more cutting weight. What do you think? I deserve this? Oh, yeah. Yes. 100%. MashaAllah. And then some nice fresh bread. So let's have it out there. Wow. This is a six hours.